let's see. But my Demos Vikings are doing a great job cleaning up these tanks. <laughs> All right, what is up? And we are back with some Han and Horner this time for this week's Direct Strike Weekly Brawl. Let's get the refinery because there is only a cord. That means there's no middle income. And we're going to open aggressively with some Reapers. Uh, we're gonna open uh, very aggressively with some Reapers because Reapers do bonus damage to buildings. Uh, am I correct? Yeah, bonus damage to buildings. And why do we need to do the bonus damage to buildings? Because this is Stronghold. Um, so we have a base being constructed and there are gonna be a lot of buildings. So with Han and Horner, my game plan is I'm just gonna go mass Reapers until I tech switch into um, Asteria Raids. I think that's what I'm gonna do. And uh, let's go. We're gonna do that. Oh, enemy is also Han and Horner. Except he went Hellbats. Interesting. Okay, so let me get this power level going. Uh, and then put it over here. And then make sure that his power levels. Okay, so my Reaper is just throwing grenades at it. There we go. 20 damage per hit. Blast that thing down, Reaper. Uh oh, he's gonna die horribly to those Sentinels. Okay, so my enemy's also Han and Horner. So uh, we're gonna have some mutual agreement on what we're gonna be doing, probably. Uh, Reaper's got. Oh, they didn't get cheaper? I, I was told that they got cheaper. Okay, well, I guess. I guess uh, the the buff slash nerf didn't go through. Um, here we go. Put down some more Reapers. I put down the missile turret over here. Uh, looks like we have a Nova on our team. Right. And then so the last uh, modifier for this week's brawl is the hybrids, um, which we've technically all seen already. Uh, we have a Dahak on our team. We have a Nova. Okay, interesting. Our SCV is just wandering around. There's a Hellbat here. There's another Hellbat here. Uh, okay, SCV just got burnt. Uh, jetpack overdrive. Jetpack overdrive. Let's go fly above those hellbats. There we go. And we're gonna go for tier two. Just kill those probes. Bro, look at those. Reapers are amazing at destroying buildings. Look at that. Boom, boom. Remember when Reapers in PvP had this ability? And then they had to nerf it right into the ground because it was way too good. Um, Alright, we're just flying above these sentinels so now that they can survive. The sentinels can't even do anything towards them because they're flying in the air. That is so strong. Um, we just gotta blow up. We gotta, we gotta eliminate as many of these new structures as possible. So we are against a um, Karax. Uh, so Han and Horner, Karax, and then who is our last opponent? I don't know who our last opponent is. I actually didn't get a chance to see. Um, but you know what? I think I think. Oh, Stukov. Okay. Well, the Reapers are gonna do a huge number on these uh, on these cannons. They're excellent siege. Um, that being said, they all died. Uh, don't worry though, I got more Reapers coming up. So I can uh, at most get 6 Reaper refunded, so I'm gonna make sure I don't get too many Reapers, because I need to be able to power push for my Asteria rates. Uh, that would be uh, pretty bad if I can't uh, power push. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna blow up those cannons real quick. Just drop them bombs on it. There we go, let's go it, let's go, let's go. Uh, too bad they're on the cannon though, but we're, we're aggressively shoving it in for now. Um, so to pressure them a little bit, even though there is really no need to pressure. Uh, to be quite honest, how many Reapers do I have? I have... I have 10 Reapers, okay. So, let's just get the salvage number up um, over time. And then we'll see where that takes us. Maybe I'll get some Reapers and I'll get a Thea Raven. So that Thea Raven can help detect and also increase the damage my um, Reapers do. So let's put a Thea Raven down. Uh, let's get some more Reapers. Alright, Thea Raven. Get the multi-threaded targeting system and then just push up the refinery. Uh, by the way, if you are new to my channel and you're seeing this video for the first time, consider subscribing because I make Direct Strike videos every single day of the week. Um, so, like, if you enjoy watching it, you should really come and just drop me a sub. Uh, and, you know, honestly, there will probably be another video today. Uh, unless I put this video up at 4, I have a pretty regular schedule uploading time. Uh, or at least I try to. Right? Sometimes things happen and, uh, you know, that doesn't always go through. Oh, these Reapers are getting butchered by the Mirages here. But uh, we are we have a ghost academy getting set up and there's a nuke coming out. But where is our ghost? It's training it's only training marines. Is it is there it's only training marines. We have a ghost academy here. Come on. Let's just go for a refinery. So I have 12 reapers and currently I have 9 on the salvage. Stukov has tanks out. Uh, I'm wondering when my opponent's Han and Horn, when my opposing Han and Horn is going to go for a tech switch. Let's go put down another reaper. Second Reaper over here. I think I want to go tier 3 before I go tech switch into uh, rates. 
because uh, if I do tech, switch, tech switch into Wraiths, I would want to be able to back him up with Behemoths as well. Okay, so I think my opponent went for the Air Hybrids um, and Deimos Vikings. Interesting. Okay. Here we go. Oh, they're going to die horribly to those Deimos Vikings, I think. Um, or are they? Let's upgrade some weaponry. Come on, Reapers. Throw those bigger bombs. Um, okay. Well, I have I have eleven charges, and I can I can I can afford to put down some more reapers. We can just we can just sell all of them, uh, and then we'll see where that takes us. We got the twenty two damage on the charge, but like these things are actually going to start uh, stacking in and start starting to kill us because they are siege units. They are quite strong. Uh, let's get the tactical jump. I think I probably need to get tactical jump. My no Nova ally here has nothing but marines. Uh, I approve. They're 150 HP Marines, quite strong. Um, I think it's Marines into Karax. I think he needs to eventually go uh, Liberators, though. Because Marines into Karax still lose. These Siege Tanks are going to melt those Marines, though. Uh, okay, there we go. He has, he has, he has more Daimless Vikings. Uh, the only question is, I think Daimless Vikings might beat Asteria Wraiths in a, in a full-on fight. I actually don't know. Because um, Daimless Vikings don't have... Um, they have anti-armor and they have AoE. That being said though, um, they don't have as much HP as um, Asteria Rates. Still, I don't know I don't know how good Asteria Rates are going to be into this, because I was going to plan on tech switching into Asteria Rates and just DPSing the stuff out of all these buildings, because Asteria Rates, when they stack, Asteria Rates are very strong. Uh, it seems like in a Haunted Horror Mirror, I might have to go for... Let's see, let's go for some upgrades. Can I get some upgrades? Uh... Let's get the unregistered cloaking device, sell it real quick. Uh, let's get some more upgrades here on weapons, so that my Reapers can just push harder. So I have 14, 14 units to salvage right now, and I have 15 Reapers, uh, so he's going, he's, he's, he's doubling down on Daimless Vikings. Uh, uh, Sovereign BCs are going to lose to Daimless Vikings though, that's the thing. Uh, my huge swarm of Reapers here are just getting knocked. Uh, by these Deimos Vikings over here, but they're still charging in nonetheless. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna try and get down another Asteria raid, but this time I'm gonna upgrade the trigger override, and then I'm gonna sell it back again. I have 15. Okay, so I wonder if the, I wonder if now is the time to push. I feel like now is the time to push, but I don't know how many um, Asteria rates I'm going to be getting back. So maybe I could just uh, get my upgrades first. And once I get all my research done, I'm going to go tech switch. I think mean, that's what I'll do. Because I, I can basically sell all my Reapers now. Um, and let's see, I have 15 Reapers. So 65 times 10, that'll give me two Asteria rates. And then um, 65, so that's 650, and then half seven for 325. So I'll get 975 minerals back. And that'll equal to three Asteria rates. Oh god, three Asteria rates? That's not a lot. Um, that is definitely not a lot, and it's not not exactly favorable results either. Um, so let's just keep saving on money then, because uh, these 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 Asteria, these Vikings, the Amos Vikings, will do. A huge number on my units here, and uh, he has he has a raven for detection. But let's see. Also, I'm playing Hunter Hunter because I have Hunter Hunter rated like in the lower tier this week. Uh, I think in the C tier. But I'm gonna see if I can pull off like a strong victory right now. Because right now my wave is just a chump wave and it's just dying. I'm gonna I'm gonna wait one more wave. Like we can we can handle waiting for one more wave. Um, I'm gonna see if I can push some. I I'm gonna see if I can push some hybrid behemoths out. Okay, there we go. That's the wave. Uh, so let's just tech switch all these bad boys right into Asteria Rates. Give them to me. Alright, let's go. These are fully upgraded Asteria Rates and they're ready to fly. Um, and on top of that, let's drop down some hybrid. And I, I think I can, I, have, I can have enough cash to get a third hybrid, or enough energy to get a third hybrid. Uh, will I be able to? 40 seconds. We might be able to. Because like, they're pushing into us, we might lose, maybe we'll have to give up the bunker actually. Um, uh, but that's no big deal. It's just the, it's just a stack. We need a death stack push. This is a very risky gambit, just because, uh, Deimos Vikings do do very well into armored air units, and, uh, these are armored air units. So let's, let's, let's see how this works out for us. Uh, we got the 400 HP on the rates. 
get that armor upgrade because I don't think I can get a, I don't think I can get a, oh, a second wraith. Let's see. Um, can I get out a second wraith? I mean, like another wraith? Because that that's our that's our Not nexus. I mean, our, our bunker taking damage. Okay, Not so there we go. Minerals. I got a triple hybrid push. Get that on there, and then we're gonna delete all these Stukov tanks because Stukov doesn't have any anti air right now. Like, um, there we go. Suddenly my wave is gone, and suddenly it's a stereo rates. Let's go. Uh oh, but can a stereo rates beat these Han and Horner Vikings? Let's see. Um, uh, I'm curious because I, I think I, I don't know if they can, but uh, looks like when, with them all stacked up like this, it looks like they are doing quite a good number on them. Uh, and the hybrid are forcing them to land, but I think I think Han and Horner's Daimos Vikings would actually win. So I need I think I need Daimos Vikings of my own um, in order to fight with the rates here. Like I, the Daimos Vikings will will uh, do some powerful damage to these armored units, uh, but the rates ultimately are my real DPS for the ground. Uh, okay, so we managed to push them back. My allies are pushing in with another wave, uh, but. Let's hit the wild missiles. I don't know. Maybe I should have got some more Daimos Vikings instead of going pure rates. But we'll see. The rates are quite powerful. Um, so, Daimos Vikings are landing. Um, oh, he has a Dominator. And he has an Assault Galleon. Interesting. Okay. Well, we got Creeper Host from Dahaka. Um, and Impalers. So, uh, those should be fine. Those should do well. If he destroy his if he destroy his detection, I think that might be it. Because he has no detection. Oh, no. I think this hybrid's detector. It's a detector. Oh my goodness, it's a detector. Alright boys, it's a detector. Uh, oh my god, Karish just obliterating it with the Annihilator. Let's get another Deimos Viking, but we're gonna I think we have to go push for a refinery. We've stabilized, I would say. Uh, actually, no, we have not. We have not. Uh, Nova needs Siege Tanks. I don't know why Nova's not going for Siege Tanks. Um, Nova needs Goliath Siege Tank, if anything. Uh, but she's not going for that. Like Nova's siege tanks are so powerful this this week's brawl that like just by going siege tank she can win the game uh, for us. But uh, it looks like that's not happening. Um, so we gotta figure. Oh, add space here all along. Okay. Uh, can we deal with this? We got the shred rounds. Okay, so that's our base going down. Uh, okay. So I I just have too many demons. I mean I have too many asteroid rates right now. Uh, and they're doing a good number, but oh my god, those those Deimos Vikings coming in, fresh Deimos Vikings. Uh, oh, did I get rid of their their detection? And they got rid of their detection. They can't see. They're getting blasted. All right, I got rid of their detection. That's one way to do it. Uh, never mind. There we go. There's observers here now. Uh, I wonder if I can scan and just destroy the observers. Okay, so Carrick's Phoenixes. Doing a good job at attacking us. Nova needs siege tanks. I, let me tell her. Nova, you need siege tanks. Uh, like, you need siege tanks to beat this. Like, the Haka is doing a good job with the creeper hosts. Those are good. They're stacking. Um, and I need more Deimos Vikings, I think. I need more guys on the field. Uh, let's see. But my Deimos Vikings are doing a great job cleaning up these tanks, uh, but they are not going to do a good job against all of these. Oh, they got scanned too. Oh, he has another Raven here. Okay, there we go. The Raven's down. Um, but oh, this one Deimos Viking is under. I mean, this one a Steeder Wraith is undetected. Here we go. It's just blasting away at that Deimos Viking. Like a Steeder Wraith do good DPS. That's the thing. Uh, and the fact that this one escaped off to the side. Excellent. Uh, oh yeah, blast them. Uh oh, he finally got detected. Uh, okay, so I, I think I, I need I need a few more Demos Vikings. I need a Demos Viking here, and then I need another Asteria Raid. Because Demos Vikings are really there to tank and uh, do anti-air. But I think I need to get some ground units so I can buff up the HP of my air units. So I think I'll probably have to get some Hellbats actually, uh, rather than sell, rather than um, yeah, I need some Hellbats on the ground. That or Grants one percent life to. Wait, widow mines grant life to my units. Okay, then I'm gonna get some widow mines because widow mines are ultimately more useful in this situation because they stack and they explode. And I'm gonna do it. Widow mines. Here we go. One percent life. Yeah, these all one percent. So widow mines are probably the best option here. Um, so let's just get that because I need to make sure I buff 
the HP of my units, because if, if they don't get more HP, then like, they are so useless. It looks like I actually beat that Han and Horner wave. Uh, that's very really strange. I think I had another Deimos Vikings, maybe? I did not see what was happening. Um, but it looks like... Wow, okay. The Vikings are here. Okay, so we're, we're on the next wave, so let's just put down a bit. Let's just put down some uh, Widow Mines over here. They'll just sort of run in there. Um, I really enjoyed the fact that Han and Horner's units all have so many upgrades for them. Uh, it really, it, it like, it makes up for the fact that they have access to, like, a relatively strict sort of, like, a relatively small range of possible units. Uh-oh, somebody's lagging, and it's not me, because I can move my screen around. Um, here we go, we're gonna, we're gonna pop that, I think. Yeah, there we go. Okay, Nova has his, has her first two siege tanks, three siege tanks. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm saying. Research. That's some, that's the good stuff, Nova. Uh, it's always good to t t talk to your teammates, right? Um, rather than complain about them silently, talk to your teammates. Tell them what they should do next. Um, or give them a suggestion, right? It's always good to give suggestions. Uh, speaking of giving suggestions, uh, if you guys have any suggestions for me on this channel, uh, definitely let me know because I'm always open to taking them. Because um, I just want to make sure that these videos are as entertaining as possible um, and are as uh, watchable as possible. I don't know, like, as, like you know, something that you guys can do. Oh my god, that is, oh my, that is some insane DPS. It just went straight for the Nexus. I did not expect that one. Okay, boys. Uh, Alright, guys, let's see the overview. Uh, I did not kill that many things. That's not surprising. I did not do that much damage. That is kind of surprising. Um, so it looks like my allies actually, like, Nova actually did quite a lot of heavy lifting here. Uh, let's just let's just check out her unit, her unit composition. Uh, I think after those siege tanks came in, she definitely did a lot of damage. Enemy Han and Horner did a lot more heavy lifting than I did. That's probably because um, he went Daimless Vikings. But you know what? Rates won the game with that massive burst at the end, just yeeting the Nexus. Uh, but anyways, if you guys like that video, if you guys enjoy these kind of videos, stay subscribed, stay safe from the virus, guys, and stay inside. Until next time, I'll see you guys later.